I'm just swatting at an image. Swat harder. I don't have enough ammunition. Blair's service record, finally. Have a pleasant evening, and good luck. I love the Navy's idea of unabridged. Most of it's classified. Now I'm getting paranoid. What seems to be missing are her training records. She trained at Miramar Naval Air Station. I called them, but all I got was the runaround. What are they hiding? Beats me. But I did get the names of the training personnel on the carrier where she got qualified. This one, Ottenberg, left the service a few months ago. He might talk. I'm tracking him down. I want him in my office. I was landing signal officer on the Minnesota. I was there when Blair trained for night landings. If they'd left it up to me, I wouldn't have qualified her. Why not? She had five downs. Downs? Major mistakes. Everybody else, it's two downs, you're out. Two? They don't give you much leeway, do they? No, sir. You don't want a pilot that can't land the damn plane. Why'd they make an exception for Blair? They were under orders to qualify some female pilots ASAP. Stuff burns me up. What, qualifying female pilots? No, ma'am, qualifying bad pilots. She's that bad? She got better. She's never gonna be an F-14 pilot. You think I'm wrong? Listen to this. I kept it to cover my ass, and I'm glad I did. I felt I could no longer wear the uniform while lying to my superiors. How did Mr. Stroud take the rejection? He got very angry. He told me to take the wheel and drive. I did. Were you afraid of him? No, I can take care of myself. I just didn't want to pour salt in the wound. What happened next? He pulled a gun and had me stop on the road. He told me to get out of the car. When he turned away to open his door, I grabbed the gun. We struggled. The gun went off twice. One bullet shattered the driver's window, and the other killed him. Did you intend to shoot him? No. It was an accident. The impact of the bullet had knocked him out of the car. I went to see if he was badly hurt. He was dead. What did you do then? I drove off. Why did you do that? I left the scene to report the accident. I headed back towards the ship, but by the time I got there, I started to see how unlikely it was I'd be believed. I've seen what happens to women who try to fight back. The system is stacked against us, especially in the military. That seems cold. I've been trained to make quick, calculated decisions. In this case, I made a very bad decision, one I'll be sorry for for the rest of my life. I can't excuse it, but I truly thought I would not be believed. And in fact, you were right, weren't you? Well, I'm here. Thank you. It is your contention, on the night of Mr. Stroud's death, you were breaking up with him, the man you described as your everlasting love, the man of your dreams? Yes, I broke up with him. We've heard testimony from a waiter and a parking lot attendant that contradicts your story. Were they wrong? They didn't hear the whole discussion. Mr. Stroud humiliated you. You must have been angry. I've been trained to control my emotions. Under all circumstances. They never break free. No, they don't. You never lose control. You want to know how I conduct myself, take a look at my service record. When you do what I do, losing control is not an option. You lose control, you die. People 17. This is a recording of U.S. Navy training flight number 001954, the carrier Minnesota. Do you recall that flight, Miss Blair? Your Honor, I renew my objection to the so-called evidence. So noted. Go on, Mr. McCoy. You know what's on this tape? I'll refresh your memory. The voices you'll hear belong to Lieutenant William Ottenberg, landing signal officer on the carrier Minnesota, and to Lieutenant Blair in an F-14 
on approach for a night landing on the carrier off of San Diego. Blair, you're next in line. Negative, I'm not. Check your lineup, Blair. Watch the meatball. I can't do this. I can barely see the deck light. Keep your scan moving. I can't. I'm going to cry. Right for lineup. I can't do it. Wave off. Wave off. Wave off. Oh, my God. Raise your gear. Raise your gear. Oh, oh, God. Burner. 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 54, what's your status? 54. I can't do this, Osberg. Hand me off to Miramar. Bring her back around. You can do it. No, hand me off. Let me make a ground landing. This is a training flight, Lieutenant. You already know how to make ground landings. Yeah, because I had good trainers, not morons like you. Cool it, Lieutenant. Screw me over. I'm going to rip you a new one. Did you rip him a new one? I filed a report. Was this your first attempt at a night landing? No, it was my third. How many years have you been in the Navy, Miss Blair? Five and a half. This recording was made six months ago. At what point did you learn the steely control of your emotions you alluded to earlier? <laughs> 